Straight ahead, it's Robinson. And this time they were ready for him as they'll stop him right at the line of scrimmage. They've called his number a lot this afternoon. You wonder how much tread is left on those tires. We certainly do, but I always think back to one of my favorite coaches in the NFL. And he used to have a meeting with his running backs every year in the offseason and say, look, as many times as you're going to carry the ball, you should be able to carry it one more time. So make sure you get in shape. And they're able to get this one across the 35. All runs on this drive so far. It's first and 10. Hand off now to Robinson. No dice this go around. He's hit behind the line and taken down. Charles, why didn't they just take the knee there? You're asking the question that I'm asking as well because we've seen a lot of football where coaches decide maybe they get a little greedy. I don't know if they're doing it for stats or for what reason. We've seen it happen in college. How about in the NFL? The miracle of the Meadowlands. All they had to do was take a knee and the game was over. The Giants ran it one more time. Ball popped free. Philadelphia picks it up and wins the game. What year was that? 1978. I think it was in November. 